I can already see several areas where we would like to use AI. For example, transaction fees. You know, we have this fee parameter, and that's right now set with the update system. So the minimum transaction fee, it's a DDoS parameter. It would be so cool once we have oracles and DEXs within the system and we have some notion of the value of ADA relative to the US dollar to create an automated transaction monetary policy that can take those data points and and compare them to other networks real time. This is actually a subtle point that we've been discussing between Singularity Net platform yeah. team and Cardano platform team, right? Because uh, I mean, the transaction fee framework for Cardano now and as planned for Cardano native assets, it's fine for what we're doing with Singularity Net at, at, at this moment. But right. if we want to go like to a swarm AI or, or microservices model where you have a whole bunch of little AIs that within a second, one AI is consulting others to, to create others. I mean, if you really want to get AI by this dynamic microservices architecture, I want to have this using the blockchain rather than all, all off, off on the side. I mean, then right. and you, you need a way for some sub-networks to have substantially lower transaction fees, but then you need some a system that's intelligent in some sense to to regulate and moderate that because you you, knew, you still need to protect against DDoS attacks and, and all sorts of other things, right? So there's, yeah, there, there's a lot of areas like that where some machine learning sort of participating in the infrastructure can help a lot. And one of the things it can help with is to help make the system better able to manifest the emergence of, of higher levels of intelligence and learning, right? So you got a lot of positive right. cycles there. Yeah, and you want it to be deterministic yet dynamic, and you'd also like it to be globally aware of competition. So you'd like the agents to be able to parse all the competing blockchains and look at their monetary policies, look at their transaction policies, their transaction rates, and their relative values to each other, and then be able to pull that into Cardano and and uh, form Our, a transaction the, policy based on that. Data is there, right? I mean, it, it's the. Right. the, the the data is there in the on, on, online. You can you can you can download it in, into your AI, and the, that I think that that's 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 quite feasible.